what up everybody I'm up over here at Rhode Island School of Design once again for the film class I do this uh, seasonally every year in the winter time and in the fall fall and winter um, I guess you would call it dance modeling whatever but it's for the students continuity exercise they learn to um, edit film splice different sections together overlap um, similar scenes different angles all that good stuff so just what I've been doing Hey, yep, we met outside. He was in Laura's class. Too. Okay, yep, I yeah. know. Waiting for the kids to come in, the students, and then we're gonna get started. Here's my whiteboard, my palette that I have to work with today. So, what I normally do is um, like a small routine, 50 second routine. Simple stuff because it's a lot of lights. It's a shooting studio, so you'll see what I'm up to, okay? Um, quickly, because a lot of people ask me this question, but uh, what do I think about the state of dance nowadays, um, music? and how everything is flowing today as opposed to you know years ago when everything seemed to have meshed together not even seemed to mesh together it did dancing you know I think with all the different dancing out nowadays all the different kinds of street dancing that was birthed of course through breaking I think it's cool you know gives uh, the young kids uh, something new to look forward to something that they could grow up with and say like hey you know I remember when I was out when I was 10 years old oh wow that dance is growing if those dancers do survive but uh there's not going to be a dance that's going to survive as long as the original dances of hip-hop because they've already proven to survive as long as they did. 35 years plus. Um, and if you think about it, 35 years is still a, a young time. still a small uh, amount of time for a dance and it's still evolving. Um, you know, I even look back and say, hey, you know, that dance has changed from 15 years ago when we was doing it till 2010 now. So I'm even starting to see the the, uh, the graduation of it. But overall, what I think about dancing now, cool. You know, I kind of like what the kids are doing. Um, do I co-sign certain dances? Do I take the liberty of learning them? Kind of biased. I like the dance that we grew up doing, and I like to expand because um, I like the way it made me feel. And, and for me to feel a certain way about a dance, I have to have a, um, a fondness and a growth that I grew into it. You know, people might take uh, newer dances and mix them with old ones and create something different, a, a different hybrid. Uh, I just more or less believe in taking the original foundation dance, um, as well as some of the midterm stuff, and just expanding and creating on it. Hip hop right now, you know, is suffering certain iniquities, but hey, uh, for those who are keeping it true and keeping it real and know the history, that's the power of it. For it.
squint, to kind of see, you know, what details get lost and what highlights stay up. That's kind of what the film. So I'm gonna start off with a freeze. It's too hard to crank. Thank you. 